Chris, we got a beautiful spring morning here in uh, the Florida Keys. Uh, you think the tarpon are gonna be cooperative today? Man, it's as calm as it gets. We got some nice looking mullet. I'm gonna go out here and see if we can get that surface strike action. Absolutely. Not a, hardly a cloud in the sky. What a gorgeous day. Loving it. Let's go find them. All right, man. There we go. Another one just rolled right there. I got them. Oh. Looks like a big school, right? They're, they're definitely moving to the left. Is that what they do when they're migrating? They move down the road, as we say, toward Key West? Generally, they do. Yes, sir. I think we can set up ahead of this pack of fish here, and hopefully, we'll get a hookup. Oh, look at them right in there. Oh, look at them all. Woo! Perfect condition. There's so many fish over there. Man, this is great. Ooh. It's a roller out there. I just saw another one roll out there, off about maybe 40 yards out. Ooh, look at that one. Oh, yeah. That's back in the neighborhood of your bait, huh? Oh, right there. He's coming. Closer, he's coming. Yeah, closer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all about that take and that jump, man. These tarpon are awesome fighters. They're awesome jumpers. Oh, right there on that, your mullet. That's he's me. After. That's me. Oh! oh! Big hit. Get him, John. It's me. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> wow. We're on a fish. Oh, oh my god! Sport Fishing Television, powered by Ram. Welcome to another episode of Sport Fishing Television. I'm John Brownlee, your host today, and we're here in Marathon, Florida, tarpon fishing. And I have one on right now. Awesome. Down here at 1 o'clock, he's going to jump, maybe 12. Look at that guy. <laughs> that was awesome. And that, fish is, that fish went for the touchdown on that last run. I know, man, all the way out of the water. Now, one bit of fish was in the water. Oh, yeah, we're getting on top of him now. Yeah, he's not far. Maybe he'll give us another jump here. Here we go. At 11 o'clock, we might get a jump. It's going to be a killer jump right here in a minute. Come on, buddy. There he is. Woo. Nice, nice dude. Oh. <laughs> Can you believe Buddy. that? I know, man. <laughs> that was awesome. Couple nice jumps out that of That was dude. awesome. That was cool. He, uh, what happened? I uh, threw the hook, man. What well, did what did tarpon do best? I bowed to him. He was already back in the water when it came out. Yeah, you bowed to him. You still got a hook. Oh, well. They throw the hook. That was pretty happens. cool, though. That was cool. Nice I'll take job. it. Let's go do another one. Let's stick another one. Hell yeah. Marathon sits squarely in the middle of the Florida Keys, and each spring, thousands of tarpon migrate through these waters on a journey that's probably millions of years old. Wait, look, I saw four roll in the next hole. That's where we're going. They're just finning and rolling and happy as can be over there. So we're going to drop right back into the shadow line, right? Oh, yeah, and this is a cool place to catch one, too, man, because they go through these arches and this bridge. You know, we follow them through. It adds a little excitement to it. There's it's no gonna doubt. It's going to be stimulating. we got to remember to take <laughs> these rods down if we hook. We that's probably right. ought to take them down except for the two we're fishing. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's get Let's ready to do that before right we now. That. Great. You've got to go. Let's get a bait in the water. A nice jumbo. Pilchard. All right, I'll go for it. <laughs> there you go. Got it, bro. All right, feed it to him. Nervous bait here. We're in the zone now. There you are. Go, go, there go, go. There he is, there he is. Him. There he is. Oh, he's going around that piling. Nice job. Oh, he's around something already. Right, we gotta, off, get, we gotta off, get off that. Off. He's already around something. That's right. Just freeze pulling. Let's go. He's gone. Is he off? 
Yeah, he's off. Oh, he just jumped man. and man, he broke me off. He was double wrapped around the bottom of that piling. We never had a chance. I mean, he I went got tried there. to give him line, man. He went he through there wrapped. immediately. And maybe there's something sticking off there, like a piece of rebar or something. Yeah, I couldn't even feed out line because he was, yeah, maybe it was some old rebar under yeah. there or something. I don't know. Pretty exciting, yeah. though. Yeah, that sucker was double wrapped around something, man. It's like he went over there and immediately got hitched on something. As soon as I came tight on him, he was already around, and that was yeah. crazy. You, know, you, right. never, you don't have a prayer for things like you gotta that. Got to jump out of him, though, man. Absolutely. You know? Absolutely, that's cool. That's a start. That's cool. Let's, let's see what we can do. We're going to catch his brother here in a few minutes. <laughs> Coming up. Let's see if they're in this hole, too. Yeah, I see them already. See their backs? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Look at them all. Holy sh. Look at them, both sides of the boat. Look at them all. Look at them all. Look at them all. Fing huge. Sport Fishing Television, powered by Ram, is brought to you by Ram, engineered to move heaven and earth. Guts, glory, ram. By Yellowfin, the choice of champions. By the new Simrad NSS touchscreen display. And by Mercury Marine. Welcome back to Sport Fishing Television, powered by Ram. Fishing conditions in Marathon included an air temperature of 88 degrees. The water was 84 degrees and slightly murky. Partly cloudy skies and light breezes came hand in hand with the rising barometer. Just let her drift down. I think we're good right now. Looks like we're going to lay right in that hole where you want to be, right? I think so. Oh, Mr. Tarpon, we have a surprise for you. We got a big pack of fish coming down the bridge right now. Chris, a lot of times the fish will lay right under this bridge up against the structure. You'll see them laid up in here like cordwood sometimes. Oh, yes, sir. They love the structure. They love the eddies behind the pilings. And they love this warm weather like we're having right now. It's got a big roll on it. Mine is really nervous. Another one rolling way out there. Just waiting for us to drift them a nice looking bait. I wish they'd show a little appreciation here. <laughs> there he is again, a lot closer, That's a little closer. Now. There he there is, there he is, is, there is. That's oh, it, yeah. yeah. Throw it off, throw it off there the anchor, is. the anchor, the anchor. We got a big boy on. Boy, he nailed that. Yeah, that was a great bite. Go ahead and throw in reverse, Sean. Awesome John. bite, I'm coming, we're in reverse. I'm coming, I'm coming back. Gotta oh, back yeah. up a little bit. I want him to get us around the pilings. You're good, John. Go ahead and crank that uh, I am. rig of yours in if you want. He's not even going in the piling. Good, good, good. Watch out what you wish what you wish for here. This is the big boy. I'm gonna turn you around. Yeah, there you go. He's heading off into the bay too. Perfect. Look at this. Here he comes. A big jump right here. Whoa! Yeah. Awesome. There we go. Man, you kicked his butt. <laughs> He's a big boy. I know he is. He's just buck 20, wouldn't you think? Yeah, man. I'm straight on top of him here. I don't know if we can lip him. And let's just get the knot in the rod and get the release, and then we'll figure out what we're going to do with him. Here he is. He's right here. All right, neutral for a sec. We're getting ahead of him. I'm in neutral. Here he comes, right here, right here. Oh, oh, oh he's going. What? I love it. How cool was that? <laughs> nice, dude. That was freaking awesome, nice dude. Job, awesome. Dude. I can't believe it. You kicked his butt in five minutes. Got the release on him, no five doubt. Five minutes, and he's awesome. gone. And I was a jumper, and that was a big fish, dude. I'm stoked. You know what time it is? Time to get another one. Have me to catch one. Yeah, I guess so. Let's, Let's go. go do it. Let's see if they're in this hole, too. Yeah, I see them already. See their backs? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Look at them all. Holy sh Look at them, both Look at sides them of the boat. Look at them all. Look at them all. Look at them all. They're huge. I mean, it was a wad of them. Solid tarpon right here. I think we just found them, bro. So, Chris, we switched up at, on the change of tide to using crabs. Is that because the mullet are harder to control, or? On the slack tide, the mullet will do circles yeah. around your boat. You can't keep it in the zone. Right. And you know the best part about a crab? You might catch a permit. And they swim with the tarpon sometimes. I've seen I know them school they do. together. I've seen it in uh, other places. It's a uh, it's sort of a fringe benefit of tarpon fishing, as far as I'm concerned. I think so. There we there go. You got him. I got somebody. Woo. Going under the bridge. He's not jumped yet. 
There'd be a permit. He's coming out this way. Let's see if we can get on him. Still not sure what he is, Chris. And our fish is right here, right here. Maybe we can see what it is. It's a permit. Is it? Yes, it is. Nice. That big black fork tail. I like it. You called it, John. You said uh, slack tide. We got a crabby for bait. We might get that permit. That's right. There he is. He's coming back this way. All right. It's on the other side. On the other side. Oh, yeah. Nice fish, John. Yeah, it is. Nice fish. He's going to come back here in the sun. It's not quite done. Yeah, he ate that bait right on the uh, shadow line. I would have sworn it was going to be a tarpon. But you know what? I'll take a permit any day, buddy. Because <laughs> he was shaking his head, you know, which is uh, a little, not terribly unusual for a permit, but now he's got that steady rhythmic permit oh. tail beat. We'll take a permit. All right, here he is. All right, I'm going to come up ahead of you there, John, and grab him. All righty, he's tired. All right, nice I'm job. Leader him right to you. Nice job. There you go. Nice big old permit. Nice. Oh. <laughs> Still got him? Yeah, man. Got a little water in my face. Yeah, that's all right. Not the first time, is it? No, sir. Woo. Boom. Got him. How about that, man? That's beautiful. Oh, yeah. I love a permit. Nice one. Those iridescent purples on them and then tail and everything. That's Are they cool. gorgeous? I mean, they got that giant tail, moves a lot of water. They're so strong. Yep. They got a little puppy else. dog face. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous. Cool, man. You know, I just soon catch a permit as a tarpon. They're one of the coolest fish that swims. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Thank you very much, buddy. Let's get him back in the water. Yeah. Let's get that hook out. Let's pop that hook out. Send him on his way. There we go. Oh, he's fine. Yeah, he ripped out of my hand. Nice job, dude. All right, buddy. Heck yeah. Let's go get a tarpon. Let's do it. Ten torque rods with matching torque spinning reels made catching the fish easy. We used braided line tied to Prospect fluorocarbon leaders with circle hooks and live baits. That's him. That may be a tarpon there. There he is. Yeah. You got him. I got him. Whoa, man, it's another big fish. Whoa. Big jump. Sport Fishing Television, powered by Ram, is being brought to you by Penn. Let the battle begin. By Berkeley Gulp Saltwater, outfishes all other bait. And by King Sailfish Mounts, offering a full selection of world-class release mounts. Now it's time for Driven to Fish, powered by Ram. Everybody wants to have a little fun while they're fishing. With Simrad NSS and the Sonic Hub, it's easier than ever. The Sonic Hub incorporates an audio player for iPod or iPhone, so you can select songs and control your music player right from the NSS display. It also works with NSE and NSO SIMRAD equipment. Sonic Hub makes a convenient, safe, and waterproof location for your iPhone while you're charging it. One Sonic Hub can network to multiple displays for the same easy-to-use control throughout your boat. With Sirius Radio activated, you also have the choice of the same control and functions for your favorite Sirius music options, sports stations, and more, right from your NSS display. Well, I tell you, we got the conditions just right, Chris. We got the, the, the tide moving the way we want. We got fish rolling, happy fish. We got great bait. I think we're going to have some good action here. I think we're in, in the just spot. Just a few man. minutes. I think we're on them. I think we're going to set up right here and get some baits out, see if we can get some action. Let's do that. Here we go. There you go. Real nervous bait here, way back. Wow, look at all the tarpon back there. This bait is freaking out, man. 
He's about to get pulverized. Oh, He's yeah, yeah, yeah. Out. He just ate it, didn't he? No, he just chased him. That was my mullet darting across the surface there. Trying to get away from somebody. Oh, 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 oh. That's him. And maybe a tarpon there. Oh, 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 there he is. He's on you. There he is. Yeah. You got him. I got him. Whoa, there we go. man, it's another big fish. He jumped straight out the back. Yeah, he's straight back. Six o'clock. Oh, Whoa! Yeah. Oh, yeah. That was an awesome bite. You see that? There we go. There you go. Big jump again. All right, here we go. It's a beautiful fish, Chris. Nice job. A little smaller, but man. man, he's awesome. That's he's a good. jumper. I like the way he's flying through the air like that, he's still kicking his tail. Looks like oh, he's yeah, trying man. to swim in the air. He's awesome. That's a hot fish, man. He is a hot fish. Ooh, there he goes again. There he goes again. All right, let's hope he stays on there. You know how good they are at throwing the hook. This is a great size fish. I think this is probably the average size fish in the Florida Keys, yep. personally speaking. Perfect size. To yeah, catch, you see a lot man. this size. But we're very close. He's right here, 2 o'clock. You just turned him good. Nice yeah. work. Spin his head a little bit. I like how we got him out here away from all the structure. Yeah, this fish is very cooperative. Went right away from the bridge. That's what we like. We like well-behaved tarpon. <laughs> Maybe he's going to give us another jump right here. Maybe. Every time they jump, you know, they're that much closer to throwing your hook is what it seems like. Well. They throw it in the air more times than not. The one fish that I caught threw the hook after he jumped and was settled back down, which is odd. You're right. You never know. You never know. Everyone is awesome, though. Here comes a jump. Yeah. We got a great fish on here, so stick around. We're going to have a lot more hot action coming up right after this. Nothing better than catching tarpon in the Florida Keys. What a fish. He is stubborn. <laughs> what do you call this, John, the Florida Keys sleigh ride? This is it. Sport Fishing Television, powered by RAM, has been brought to you by Ex Officio, made to adventure. By Yeti Coolers, wildly stronger, keep ice longer. By Isla Morada, the sport fishing capital of the world. And by Power Pole, swift, silent, secure. The numerous bridges of the Florida Keys provide pathways for the tarpon to move back and forth between the Gulf of Mexico and the Atlantic Ocean. Welcome back. I'm still hooked up to this awesome tarpon. We're going to see if we can get him up to the boat and introduce ourselves. Oh, and then let him go. Let's see what happens. You want me to get you up there closer to him, John? Yeah, he's got a little line out on me, Chris. Not a whole lot, but let's get a little bit tighter on him. All right, here we go. Well, that's a great size fish, man, to catch. Nice, nice, playful size, under 100 pounds for sure. Yep. And uh, kind of a cookie cutter fish. <laughs> yeah, cookie cutter fish. Average fish. I'll take it. Oh, baby, come on. He's tired. We mean you no harm, pal. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> nice jump, John. That was cool. <laughs> I'm going to get right up on his tail. Yeah, we're, he's right here. I'm trying to spin him around a little bit. He ain't that small. Go up a little bit, Chris, and go right. All right. It's a little right. Right and forward. Let me know when you think he's going to roll over, and I'll come up there and try to grab him. Neutral. Right under the boat, neutral. There's nothing better than catching tarpon in the Florida Keys. There's nothing like it, man. Nothing like it at all. You got to love it. Got to love it. What a fish. I know, man. Every tarpon is just. He is stubborn. <laughs> what do you call this, John, the Florida Keys sleigh ride? This is it. Yeah, he's getting tired. Yeah, he is. All right, let's let this fish go. All right, I'm coming up there to try to leader him. He's right here, Chris. Right. Got it? Here we go. Big there he old is. It's a magnificent fish, Chris. Thank you. Oh, yeah. All right. 
Good, I'm gonna hold him up to the side. We'll take a look. Look at that bad boy. Nice, healthy. Marathon Florida Keys tarpon. Is there a more magnificent fish than that? I think not. I think not. All right, buddy, you you earned your money today, pal. Yeah, we're gonna get him revived. You want me to put the boat in gear? Uh, I think we're pretty good on this one. You still kicking? He looks oh, like yeah. he is. He's oh, got yeah. a tail beat. Here we go. All right. <laughs> Nicely done, John. Thanks, man. When they decide to eat, there's no stopping them. You can sit there for hours, and they'll ignore your baits, and something happens. We both know the time of day has a lot to do with it. Time of day has a lot to do with it, yeah. and tide has a lot to do with it. It can happen any time, but if you mi maximize your chances and come when the right time and tide is, you're going to get a bite. What a nice day of fishing, man. Put a few in the air, got you a nice perm, got you a nice tarpon. Doesn't get any better. Accommodations for this episode of SFTV were provided by Banana Bay Resort and Marina. I'd like to thank Captain Chris Morrison of Keys Light Tackle Fishing Charters for a great day on the water. Closed captioning provided by King Sailfish Mounts. Next time on Sport Fishing Television, John Frazier, editor of Fly Fishing and Saltwaters magazine, travels to the jungles of Central America in search of one of the world's most sought-after game fish, giant Nicaraguan tarpon. Oh, 